Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperium Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot, and we are here on the Geek Tech Industries server in Alpha 7. And I think this is episode 10. I'm going to say 10. We're into double digits on the uh, Alpha 7 Geek Tech Industries server series. Last episode, you guys saw me build this guy. So this is our kind of a bug-eyed bug -eyed little critter. I textured him up. I gave him kind of scales. He is black in color. Now, I've also given him a, a, a kind of a funky one of the new... These are all kind of new textures here. So everyone's probably thinking, wow, that's a lot of black why is it all black where's where's the green well the green is when you turn it on sorry a little bit of video glitch in there so let's turn this puppy on and boom that texture lights up isn't that cool oops i got a little on my ship underneath there eh, that's okay So yeah, there we go. Not bad at all. Okay, so today what I was thinking of doing is I wanted to take this thing out and get some Neo and Sath and some more Pentaxid from the surface of Ninges. So let's do that. I've, I've got I built a bunch of ammo for it. So let's do that. Now I want to get in by actually going down. Come on. In. I want to come on. Come on. Where, where how am I facing? Where am I? Oh, whoa. I'm like way over there. Okay. So, uh, yeah. What? <laughs> okay. Can I? Yeah. I can go backwards. See? It's kind of trippy <laughs> and then I'll go like this <laughs> I'm like I'm like parking a ship <laughs> okay and then uh, okay okay there we go there we go there we go and I'm just floating anyway so unfortunately I don't think I oh it's just heating up still that's okay we're in safe safe zone now um, level is it Let's see we'll take the jump jetpack off that's close enough jump in let's go so let's add our stuff in that we oh we can turn the oxygen on now that we're inside uh, I don't have any pack and tax but I'm just gonna fill all now we're up to 5600 15 mil and 500 of the 130 mil that cost me that alone, those 500 missiles, cost me 500 pentaxid ore, or uh, uh, promethium ore. Yeah, half a full stack of ore, just to make those 500 missiles. So, super expensive, the 130 mil ones. The, believe it or not, the guided 135 mil um, are cheaper like 10 times cheaper on the Prometheum, but they also cost a, some cobalt. So I, I think I'd rather do the uh, guided missiles. Um, I gotta level up though. <clears throat> so, let's load our guns. guns. Nice. That looks awesome. Okay. This should be fun. So a little different with the uh, box top design going in. This shouldn't be nearly as pain in the ass. 
and this thing just stops on a dime. This thing handles really well. <laughs> it's actually... It might be one of my better SVs that I've ever built. How it flies. It flies really nice. And it's not over twitchy. So we'll see in atmosphere anyway. Now that's all going to change. Oh, I got to... Let's get away from the pole there. Uh, where do I want to come down? Damn, I'm probably going to come down right on top of the bloody base, aren't I? Let's see. We'll just drift down a little bit here. Okay, so it looks like there's some over there. It's funny. I just gotta do a tiny little, tiny little tap, and I just hover, no problem, facing straight down. That's the advantage of having overthrusted thrusters in all six directions. Okay, so there's a POI over there. I don't want it to shoot at me, so I'm just gonna go over here. Okay. So now that we're down in the atmosphere, we can kind of cruise around. We've got uh, a lot of energy, a lot of ammo. We've got food on us. We should put in the put in the fridge here. So did I? Is everything? No. Okay. So I need to actually group everything again. There we go. So. We've got our fridge, we'll just throw this in there while we get hungry. We also have a constructor in this thing, so if we shoot up things, things cook them up. So pentaxid, pentaxid, you can see the crystals right here, so here we go. Let's, um, let's pick these. Whoop so fast in the niggas I'll damage my ship. So let's jump out and then we actually have to jump out, jump out. Let's put on our jetpack, get our gun going and I do believe I have, yeah, Eva boost. Okay, I heard something. something no okay let's just jump out get this metaxid so it gives me two per and then each of those refines up uh, to double that. So just those two alone would give me eight refined. Which is halfway to a short jump. So not bad. So this shouldn't take too long. Let's keep collecting these. Whoa! Okay, this thing has massive thrust. It's like instant full speed. <laughs> In every direction. Okay, so let's... <laughs> it's not really twitchy, I just gotta get used to this, the super awesome thrustis, thrustiness.
But it'll just stay in the air, won't it? Shut off? Let's try. <sighs> oh no, there it goes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wrecking my ship already. <laughs> oh god. Probably already damaged it. Let's uh let's jump in and take a look at our derpaginess. <sighs> okay. Uh nope, we haven't damaged it yet. Okay. Oh, okay. That's fine. Let's get out. Get these things. And I'll switch to the drill and do stone removal. Seven Promethean. Nice, nice. Okay, well, that was only one crystal. Yeah. I guess the Promethean made it seem like there was more around. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Come on. Let's try that again. Just jump up. Come on. Come on. No! <laughs> yeah, the multi boost can sometimes, on low gravity, make it a little difficult jumping because, yeah. Okay. More crystals, more crystals. So there's the barrier. Okay. Uh, what else? Come on. Let's get these. Come on here. Okay. Is this just like on? Did we just pick that one up there? Like. So we're touching. Let's level off. We'll just, oops. Oh, it's so thrusty that it thrusts straight down. <laughs> okay, let's jump out. Then we'll get this. And whoa. There's the other one there. And is there another one? There was another one up here, right? Unless there was one I already picked. Oh, I didn't make more cava. Oh yeah, see, I've already picked that. Okay, well. What does that give us so far? 10. That'll refine into 20. Not bad. I've got a full tank at home in the CV, so that's not bad. We're getting up there. We're getting close to 100 refined. Oh, there's a critter. Should I kill it? I say yes, but not with missiles because they're too expensive. Oh, he just went down in a fast heap, didn't he? There's another guy there. So we'll take care of him. Okay. And then we'll just go like this and slowly drift down and touch. And then we'll get out like this. And we'll just do a little jump, bring out our drone, and get the dead bodies. Come on. Too far away? Yeah, too far away. Try. Okay. I'm trying to learn to not touch the throttle very much on this thing. It is a little touchy on the throttle because it's super overthrusted, but in combat I'll appreciate that. Trust me. Seaweed, nice. Not that I need the biofuel. Okay. What's our level at anyway? Oh, we're really close to 14. Good, because I need to level to learn the the um, the guided 
missile or is that level 15? That might be level 15. Much. It always switches the missile. Okay, so this <laughs> thing is like hyper fast. Just bing bing. It's like ricochet rabbit. This is just a big bug eye bus that's super fast. It's a hot rod bus. Okay. I get used to the throttle of this thing, this thing is going to be awesome for me. It's going to slow down though once I uh, make it heavier with the Satium, so I don't think it's going to be as to... Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> don't be leaping out like a leaping gnome. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not much. They were just good XP is all. Where'd that other guy go? He was down there somewhere, wasn't he? I don't even worry, know where he went now. Okay, I'm not going to worry about it. Okay, you know what? We've kind of dallied here killing stuff when I really need to be... Oh, there he is. I might as well grab him. Oh, got to kill this guy too. Switch to the guns. Go and uh, I'll just jump out. I think it killed anything that was a threat around here. Ship. No? Okay. Let's uh, keep looking and shooting and killing and looting. Uh, these guys just give not, not, well, I mean, you know, water, oxygen, promethium, and dirt. Uh, right now we're time. We, we don't have the time to mess with those guys. They're good for XP, and that's about it. <laughs> the, uh... I guess if I really needed the oxygen. Here we go. Look at this. There we go. A bunch of vent. Yeah. This is what I was looking for. A mountaintop of pent. Okay, so now i got to be careful. I don't want a POI. Or the... I don't want the patrol vessel sneaking up on me, right? So let's... No, okay, I don't see it. I don't see it. Okay, so let's... Let's land somewhere here.
good enough. Jump out. Try that again. Jump out. Get these ones first. That's unfortunate. I don't have any coffee. This is going to slow this process down. Oh, wait. Do I have coffee? Did I have some? Yeah, I got some. Not much. Pretty much. I guess I could have. I could make some purified water with all that water. Oh yeah, I guess I could make purified water. Huh. Gotta keep an eye on the radar. Don't want that CV showing up with me way out too far from my SV. That would just suck. This and uh, we'll grab it. <sighs> How can I pass up some I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah, the golems had them too, but that there's potentially more in that stone. Ooh, level 14 from Pick and Pent. Nice. Be. I don't want to use up all my stamina stuff right now because if I need to run back to the ship I got to be able to have that stamina available so I'll just let it regen a bit on its own while I walk up here and get these Those are good chunks. I want to run so bad. I should have grabbed... Well, I don't have a way to make coffee, actually. I have to pick coffee. I'd have to find a farm or something to loot. I don't know. I don't know. Well, I'm glad I dinged, because that'll allow me to take a couple things that I wanted to take that I couldn't. And how are we for Pent now? 28, so that's 56 refined. We're getting up there now. We're, we're well over 100 refined. So let's pick these other here on the way back down. Okay, I'll use my stamina now. Okay. So, not bad, not bad. That'll give us enough, you know, what's in the ship right now, because it has like 64 plus another 10 or so, and then we just picked 32, so another 64, so another full tank. So nice, okay. So good, we got we got our pent quota, I think. Let's get some Sath and Neo. So what do we got on the map here? We have discovered Neo up there beside a settlement, close to an oxygen depot and a silo though. Okay, we've got Sathium way up there all on its own. And Neo over here all on its own. We've got Sathium down there, Prometheum. So 12,000, okay. And 1,200. And 12,000. And 8,400. And Cobalt 
4,300. Okay, so that's only 1,200. What's, what's this one? 2,500. Okay. Okay. Um, well, we're not going to be able... Well, I guess we could mine out one of those, but we don't need... So that's the TS Ningas. I don't know where the platform is. So, just in case, and there's a, a CV poking its head over a mountaintop, bearing down on me. No. Okay. Um. Hmm. Let's see which. So there's iron right there. Or should we explore more? I think we should probably explore more and see what we can find. So let's get a waypoint to there. Yeah, I know we're we're flying by Pent, but I have a feeling we'll be able to pick up more wherever we go. I just and with the missiles now, we can actually go back to Akua to the moon. And oh, there we go—a big, not oh, big enough, big enough for what we need right now, and nothing around it at all. So we'll just have to be. And what, Neil? Really? Oh, and Neil! Wow, epic, awesome, silicone. Okay, so we could probably even use the silicone. I don't want to bring the. Uh, CB down though. Okay, so let's do this. And more Sathium. Wow. Okay, so there is like a shit ton of Sath and Neo on Ingus. That's good. That's good. close here. Basically get right over top of it for the most part. Iron. Wow, this is a real rich little uh, valley here. And I'm just gonna... whoops. What am I on top of? Come on. There we go. Okay, so let's get out and then Drone it up, and we'll just close this to, so that critters don't. Uh, and we'll tab so to get our radar back. Okay, I don't see a CV. I don't see a CV. It's that black, sleek-looking CV. It's got big wings to it and like a V-tail. So it's pretty distinct. Yeah, okay. Let's let's take on this ore. So I can't see the... Do I not have my scanner on me? Yeah, I got my ore scanner. Let's pick it up, put it down. And I still can't see. Is it because of the snow? 19. Well, let's dig down. stuff now. So I couldn't see it through the snow. Keeping an eye on the radar all the time. So the hand drill, the P2 hand drill is, is really fast and 
not too bad now to mine out a deposit with it because you can really focus with the ore scanner directly to the deposits now. And I find you can get a lot really quick. Um, the T1 drills. God, that's nice. Why isn't it? This must be a massive one. Wow, 629. What? That was crazy. I almost have a full stack. See that? Crazy. Two chunks. So yeah, they made the they made drilling faster. For the for the hand drill anyway, I the the T1 drill on the HV kind of gets hung up on these things. It just, I don't know, it doesn't do that great of a job. It's really hard to maneuver around and it's a pain in the ass. The, um, the laser drills for the HV though work incredibly well. They have no problem with these things. So, and I'll be, I'll be putting them on right away as soon as I can. I just don't have the material or the levels to do that. Wow. Wow. Come on. Wow, a 714. Did you guys see that? 714. Let's see this one. Two hundred and fifty one. Wow. so far <laughs> almost two full stacks wow. Realistically, now that I have missiles, I could probably easily take out the CV when if it showed up anyway. That just reminded me I, I wanted to <laughs> take a look around. I don't know if we're in its flight path or not, right? So, got to be vigilant because these things sneak up on you. Okay. Get back down in here. And look for ore so that I see a blob over here. Oh, that's down here. Okay. So, through here. So, yeah, this will be good. We can get this. And we got some pens today. And I want to get some of that Neo and even the silicone, I guess. Do a silicone and copper, so I'll probably fly around and get that. Uh, so yeah, the ship is working awesome. This is exactly what I built it for, and I'll be able to take this ore home and actually make the ship even better, make it really combat worthy. Harden it all up. Yeah, sometimes mining is really peaceful. And you're just kind of winding down at the end of a hard day. Drone mining can be relaxing. But it's a little bit more stressful on a PvP planet 
with a CD flying around. So, yeah, it's not that relaxing. <laughs> I'm actually all kind of freaked out now that you think about it. I'm like constantly looking at my radar and just... Getting, oh, that was a good chunk too. So what are we at here? Oh my god, um, four and a half stacks. Uh, well, there's one right here. I can't not mine it. These are some epically large chunks. Wow, this was taking a while. 683. And then the bigger ones. So I need to just get it now. stacking. What's up with that? Let's fill them up. It's weird. Okay. Three, four, five, six, seven. It's, wow. Okay. So I think we're almost we're almost done this one. I think it's just these couple nuggets here. We might as well mine it out then. We'll, we'll do a courtesy cap on the well. Really? <laughs> oh, that's 
<laughs> oh my god. Well. Oh well. <laughs> Such is life. Let's get this Neo. dude. Did I... Well, that, oh, there he is. <clears throat> Just pick this up. Might as well, right? We killed him. Okay. Well, I think we are at the end of our time for this episode, folks. So what did we get for, for in the in our pent pent 32 and Sathium we ended up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A little basically we, we ended up with eight full stacks. Uh, that will smelt down into sixteen stacks of, of ingots. So that's sixteen thousand. 16,000 ingots. So let's put that into the. I don't think the mobile constructor can, can do that. Can it? Let's see. I don't think it can anymore. No. Can't even do cobalt. We can do pent though. Uh, yeah, I don't need to. Okay. So let's. Put the raw meat in there. And you know what? We can actually cook that up. Okay. We've got milk. And we'll eat some veggies. We've got raw meat coming up. Or uh, salami coming up. So we'll eat that. Neo right here and head back to the ship and have that smelting and uh, go to bed. So it was a good episode. I didn't die. What am I at here? I'm at uh, 14th level. It's kind of hard to see there. 14th level, 67 kills, zero deaths. So yeah, we're getting there. Uh, how close am I to 15th though? Mm, not really. That's okay. That's okay. We'll get there. We'll get there. And I'll put the... I guess I could do that right now. Right here and now. Or should I? Yeah, I can. There's another object in that. Let's... Come on. There we go. We'll, uh... We'll do Bug Eye. The Bug Eye Bus. So we'll take the, by hitting Alt and O at the same time, that brings up your Blueprints menu. And then you can save whatever you're 
looking at, and I'm going to call this the Bug Eye Bus. And now I'm going to go back in to my blueprints and make sure that it's the right thing. Yep, that looks good. So, Bug Eye Bus, our little hot rod SV takes 908 iron, 540 cobalt, 440 copper, 327 silicone, 160 neo, and 64 sap. So that is before I increase it with with better missile launchers and um, inject sathium into it for hardened iron or hardened uh, um, steel. So yeah, that'll get way more expensive after I do that. And then I guess I'll republish that, the, the, the updated one. Anyway, guys, if you like this episode, like and subscribe. Uh, and I will see you guys in episode 11. You guys have an awesome day.